And we begin right now with an eight year old boy lost and wandering on Detroit's east side after being put on the wrong bus at school. Now we heard from his mother last night. Tonight, the Good Samaritan who saved the day has come forward. Mara McDonald live downtown. Uh, he doesn't think he did anything special though, Mara. I tell you, Devin, when I called him to see if he talked to us, he's like, what do you want to talk to me for? I didn't do anything important. Well, let me tell you, I know a lot of people who disagree. Let me show you. Human instincts kicked in and said that this kid was in trouble. Will Eland was walking home from work when he first noticed the little boy near Seven and Conant. Like, I got nieces and nephews that size. So it was like, kid on the ground crying is like, Something's got to be wrong. That kid was eight year old Denver Young, who'd been put on the wrong bus at Barber Prep Academy in Highland Park and dropped off on the east side of Detroit, far away from his correct bus stop at Six in Livernoy. I got the question, um, and uh, he was a tough little cookie. He like didn't give out their information so fast. Denver's mom, Kirsten, had told him not to talk to strangers, but he was lost and had been wandering in the area for hours while his frantic mother was going between two police departments to get to the bottom of what happened. I stood there with him for quite a while and so I realized no one was coming to get him. Denver didn't know his address, but he knew the street he lived on. Will Googled it on his phone and had the boy pick out his home. And then I looked up and the city bus was coming. So I just told him, grab my hand and we ran across the street and we got on the bus. I told the bus driver, hey, I don't got no money, but I'm trying to get this kid home. And he said, all right, I'm only doing it for the kid. And he let me he let us sit on the bus and ride. When they got to the area, Will got off the bus and helped Denver find his way to his house tonight. He still doesn't think he did anything out of the ordinary. I just thought it was the right thing to do. Back here alive, I know a lot of people who think that Will is an angel. And how about that city bus driver who said, get on, uh, you know, you may not have any money, but I'm doing it for the kid and I'll get you home. Uh, Denver told his mom that he thinks Will saved his life. We're live downtown tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. Very, very sweet. Most, most heroes don't recognize themselves in the stories, right? Yep. All right, Mara.